Joey, I did it. I got you an audition for the new Kevin Smith film. Wow, Clerks was like the best independent movie of all time. Yeah. Oh, that and Con Air. Yeah. Well, if this doesn't work, you're screwed. All right, you're gonna read for the producers tomorrow. All right, nail the audition. You need to get this part. Okay, I get it, Bob. Thank you, thank you. Uh, hey, man, you won't waste your time reading for some producers. I can get you a meeting with Kevin Smith. I cannot believe you're hooking me up with Kevin Smith. Man, I got a good feeling about this. He's gonna love you. Well, I'm, I'm just so excited to meet him. And me too. <laughs> what, what, what? You don't know him? No, but he's good friends with Ben Affleck, and I love Ben Affleck. What? He's not gonna talk to us. Of course he's gonna talk to us. We're bringing him back his dog. We don't have his dog. I think we have his dog. <laughs> It's gonna be the classic Hollywood story. He's gonna love you, and great things are gonna happen. All right, let's okay, do this. Let's do it, baby. Oh, oh, oh man, I, why did you let it go? Damn it, we gotta get the dog back. Oh, of all the days not to have meat on me. What the hell's going on here? Uh, my friend Joey here just returned your dog. Mm. You see, he was trying to pet it one last time. When you risk your life to save an animal, there's a real special bond. So he risked his life, did he? No. Yep. Where'd you find her? In a knife factory. <laughs> That is just the least convincing performance I've ever seen, and I've directed Ben Affleck. <laughs> Look, I think I know what's going on here. You steal the director's dog, return it to his home, hoping that he'll give you an audition in his new movie, am I right? That's cool, let's just cut to the chase. What part are you interested in? Uh, I prepared the role of Frankie. Frankie, huh? Yeah, I kinda see you as a Frankie, but can you act? Let's find out, come on in. Uh, listen, Mr. Smith, I, I can't thank you enough for this. You know what? It's totally cool. Don't thank me. I enjoy discovering new talent. So let's get rolling, shall we? I want you two to take your shirts off and start making out with each other. <laughs> what? I'm just kidding. This is actually working. And thank God there's no little voice in my head messing me up. Not again, no! You want to sit or stand for this? Come on, just pick one! I will stand. <laughs> you handled that well. No, he didn't. He's gonna fail. Oh no, there's two voices now? Also, there's me. <laughs> there's a French one? Nah, I'm the first one. I was just doing a voice. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. Just, just clear your head. You know what, you don't look so good, man. You want me to get you a drink or something? Uh, yeah, actually, that would be great. What do you want? We got uh, water, or lemonade, I got Perrier. Take the water. What are you talking about? Take the lemonade. No, no, no. Take the Perrier. <laughs> stop it, just stop it. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I, I gotta go, I gotta go. I take a diet slice. <laughs> I can't believe this. I just screwed up the opportunity of a lifetime. I I've been up for big parts before. Why am I hearing these voices now? Oh, man, stop beating yourself up. So Kevin Smith is out. We just go to plan B. Check this out. I happen to know where Jeff Bridges gets his dry cleaning done. <laughs> oh, you're here. I spoke with Kevin Smith. He thinks you're absolutely fabulous. He's a huge fan. Okay, look, Gina, don't sugarcoat it, all right? I can take it. I'm a man. Oh, okay, because your mascara kind of threw me. Ha <laughs> ha